have more in common with animals than we think. They actually can help define our internal clock, aka our chronotype. So I visited the Valley Sleep Center to talk with clinical sleep educator Lori Ledley about what the different animals mean. First up, the lion. As you know, a lion is a fierce animal. So in a lion chronotype, you're going to be somebody who is early riser. You do your most productive things in the morning. If you're a lion, you wake up with lots of energy and ready to go. But by early evening, you're exhausted. When they start to feel tired, it's a good idea to maybe take a walk if it's too early in the evening. Because they might be ready for bed at 3. Because <laughs> they've been raring to go the whole day, right? Well, they've been going. On, yeah, depending on how early you wake up. So lions shouldn't leave big projects to do at night when they're not at their peak. Our next animal, the bear. The bear internal clock rises and falls with the solar system. So the sun comes up, the bear wakes up. The sun goes down, the bear falls asleep. You want to exercise as soon as you wake up to get going. Bears usually are the type to press the snooze button maybe once or twice. Yeah, they don't want to get up right away. Are you a bear? <laughs> I press the snooze button a good seven times if I have to. The bear makes up 50% of the population. And Lori says that if you think you're a bear, a 10 to 20 minute nap in the middle of the day will leave you refreshed to finish the rest. Next up, the wolf. So the wolves are more nocturnal and these are our people that want to stay awake late at night and then they sleep in later in the morning. So high school, college age, young adolescents. That sounds like my college days. Yes, <laughs> they like to party late at night and they want to sleep all day. So you should do your most important work later in the day when you're the most productive. So is one animal chronotype better than the other? No, in fact, you don't really want to strive to be one animal over the other. Find out what your chronotype is and learn to adjust your life around that to maximize when your brain is the most alert. They're all great in my book. But if you didn't see your sleep animal, head on over to thelisttv.com where you can learn about the dolphin. There are hope for you dolphins. <laughs> We're sleeping in the wild on the top of the list. For everything that's new now and next, go to thelisttv.com.